Hi everyone, welcome to session 5 of the Habits program. In the past 4 weeks, we have learned how to make our lifestyle a healthier one. In session 2, we learned how to be fat and calorie detectives and to track what we eat. Session 3 was about making healthy food choices. And in session 4, we kick-started our activity plan. In today's session, we will focus on one of the most crucial ways in which we can start eating healthy. We are going to identify and change habits that have become part of us over the years. We'll understand how things in our environment can cause us to eat unhealthily or be inactive. These are called food and activity cues. We'll also learn to identify our problem areas. And what's the point of identifying a problem if you don't identify a solution? Our five friends have been trying to make their lifestyle better for the past four weeks. Let's see how they're doing. How's everyone doing? Very well. How are you? Very well, Madam. Now, Khairiyat, tell me. Hello, good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Hey, you know, I saw the film yesterday, Farhan Akhtar. It's very big. And when I saw it, I felt like I would become an athlete. You feel like you feel like it. Okay, everyone, I want to sit with all of you before we begin today's session. Why? What did we do? Don't worry, Tanya. It's nothing. Since you asked, we'll begin today's session. Why? What did we do? Don't worry, Tanya. It's nothing. Since you asked, let's just begin with you. Come. Oh, that is why I shouldn't have opened my big mouth. Abhi tak tu khush hai? We'll see. Playing machine. Aaj to phas gaye. Okay. Shall we begin? Yes. Tanya, let's check your weight and then we'll see your tracking. Come. That's great. You've lost half a kilo this week. So tell me, how's your week been? Half a kg? Wow, I'm really happy. I managed to lose some weight. It was a problem, but I'm finding it very difficult to control my eating. Okay, let's have a look at your tracking. It's true, uh, you've been having a lot of things that you should not be. I can see a lot of popcorn there. Oh, I went to watch a movie with friends. Ke you know, I'm finding it very difficult to eat a balanced meal. The more I try to control myself, the more I feel like eating what I shouldn't be. Control in you, but you still managed to lose weight. I think that's probably because although you've not been able to follow your calorie goal, you have stuck to your activity goal. So that's good. Uh, but we need to figure out a way for you to follow your calorie goal as well. Okay, great. Um, Raghu, you're up next. Okay. So how has your week been? Um, it's been quite easy actually. I've really been enjoying exercising again. That's great. Let's check your weight. Uh, can you get on the weighing scale please? Sure. Raghu, you've lost 1.5 kgs in the last one week. That's great. But uh, I don't want you to go overboard. You know, it's not really a good idea to lose too much weight over a short period of time. So let's have a look at your tracking. How's your exercising routine been? I've been exercising about 90 minutes a week. I know you said uh, 60 minutes, but I just feel so refreshed after exercising that I just keep at it. That's great. The most important aspect of exercising is that you enjoy it. But everything should be in control. Even exercising, for example, should be in moderation. But kudos, keep it up. Thank you. Shall we move on to the next one, Mrs. Parikh? Sure. I have to say that you're looking very pretty today. Lovely oh. sari. <laughs> thank you, thank you. Ye mere husband ne lake diya mere ko. He is very happy that I stick to whatever you tell me. Isliye unhone mere ko bola ye mera prize hai. Very nice. Let's check your weight. Dekho, kuch kam hua kya? Arey wah, Mrs. Parekh, aapka to 1.5 kgs aur kam ho gaya. Agar last week ka tally kare to you have totally lost 2.5 kgs, which is great. Hamare pure project ka goal is 4.75 kgs. Good job. आप भी मेरे को एक साड़ी दे दो ना। इससे बेटर गिफ्ट तो आपने खुद अपने आप को दे दिया है। Aren't you feeling fitter? Right. वैसे your tracking is also very detailed and आपके activity levels भी up हो गए हैं। Very good. Keep up the good work, Mr. Khan. श्रेया मैडम, please गुस्सा मत करना। वो क्या है ना tracking में जरा problem हो रही है। अच्छा, पहले weight check करते हैं, फिर देखते हैं। Mr. Khan, your weight has increased. Let's see what you've eaten. Mr. Khan, when you're tracking properly, then we're able to pinpoint what the problem is and zero in on how much you should eat and how much you should exercise. 
अगर आप अपने काम को इतना सीरियसली लेते हैं इस प्रोग्राम को भी लेंगे देन यू विल श्योरली सी रिजल्ट्स। काम के बीच में ना जरा ये ट्रैकिंग वगैरह मुझे बहुत डिफिकल्ट लगती है हाँ मिस्टर खान पर आपने लास्ट वीक ट्रैकिंग करी थी तो यू एबल टू लूज वेट अगर आप ठीक से ट्रैकिंग करेंगे देन वी विल बी एबल टू आइडेंटिफाई द प्रॉब्लम यू हैव टू रियलाइज द इम्पोर्टेंस ऑफ ट्रैकिंग हाँ बट अभी देखिए श्रेया मैडम मैं एवरी डे नाउ आई वॉक फ्रॉम पार्किंग टू द शॉप एंड आई स्टॉप ईटिंग कबाब इन द लंच और बीवी जो पैक करके देती है वही खाता हूँ दैट्स ग्रेट बट थोड़ी और कोशिश मिस्टर खान अगर आप ठीक से ट्रैकिंग करेंगे तो बेनिफिट आपका ही होगा ठीक है इस हफ्ते फिर बेटियों को लगा देता हूँ काम पर मिस्टर <laughs> खान नहीं नहीं मजाक कर रहा हूँ बुरा मत मानिए ओके चरित्रा हाउ वॉज योर वीक गुड इट वॉज इन बैड बट आई डोंट रियली थिंक यू विल अप्रूव अ फ्यू थिंग्स दैर आई बीन ईटिंग वाई डोंट यू जस्ट वे मी एन एल स्पिल द बींग्स ओके लेट्स चेक योर वेट या नॉट बैड यू लॉस्ट के जी दिस वीक लेट्स यूर ट्रैकिंग आई नो वॉट यू मीन chips and soft drinks huh yes i actually had a few friends over and there was just no time to cook healthy snacks and if i don't eat with them i'll just look like a bad hostess yes i understand it's all for a greater cause <laughs> but uh, very detailed tracking very impressive good work um i do notice that it's a problem for you to keep under your fat gram goal um, you can say so you have to eat more healthy food especially during lunch and in the evening Uh, I think that's the time you are in the office, right? Yes. yes. Okay. So, uh, what I would recommend is that try and not skipping lunch at work, and try and have healthy food or uh, fresh food, any home cooked food, whenever you can. Okay. Uh, packaged food is an absolute no-no. One more thing that you can do when you deal with evening hunger pangs is that you could carry a fruit in your bag. So, whenever you're hungry, you could have that fruit. Great. So now that we know how all of us have fared this week, let's get on to the lesson today, shall we? Danya, tell me, what is the secret of your unending hunger? Because when I see food, my mind cuts off eating. Okay. Shall we begin? Yes. Yeah. So today we are going to talk about food cues. What we'll do is that we learn how to take charge of what's around us, and to see how we can make what's around us support our habits goals. Is का मतलब जैसे कि हमारे आसपास ऐसी काफी चीजें होती हैं जो हमें खाने पर मजबूर करती हैं. These are called cues or triggers. We'll be also talking about activity cues, but uh, sometimes what happens is that because of where you are or what you're doing, it affects your eating habits. so it is like a cue to eat so what do you think what are the things that make you want to eat hunger correct oh. yeah. hunger so that is the first cue hunger but uh, what about the times when you are not physically hungry but you still eat like sometimes it may be because of your emotional state what you're thinking or how you feeling like uh, you may have a piece of barfi or cake just because you're not doing anything or maybe that's the first thing you see in the fridge right exactly so sometimes you also eat because of the behavior of the people around you something that the other person has said to you or done to you yeah like that would be me at my party i just kept on eating chips non stop because they were passed on to me exactly and you know sometimes you also eat because of the mere sight or the smell of food and also there are certain activities that make you want to eat like watching tv makes you want to eat junk food another example is eating popcorn at the movies just like tanya did yeah we eat popcorn while watching a movie wo to normally hai na hmm so you're saying that eating popcorn at the movies is a habit for you hmm when you respond to a food cue in the same way over and over again it becomes a habit like in your case you when you go to the movies you have to have popcorn even if you're hungry or not so what is the cue in this case the cue is the movie exactly so these food cues and eating habits are not harmful by themselves but sometimes they end up making you have extra calories and fat so the best thing to do is to avoid these food cues or let alone just keep them out of your sight मतलब आई स्टॉप गोइंग टू द मूवीज नो तानिया यू सच अ ड्रामा क्वीन यू रिमाइंड मी ऑफ माई लिटिल सिस्टर उसके लिए भी हर चीज एक्सट्रीम में है आई मेन्ट जस्ट स्टॉप गोइंग टू द फूड कॉट सो दैट वे द कनेक्शन बिटवीन वॉचिंग अ मूवी एंड हैविंग पॉपकॉर्न इज ब्रोकन आई एम गोन ट्राई दिस एंड सी येस यू शुड और यू कुड डिवेलप अ न्यू हेल्दी हैबिट सच एज वेल यू कुड रिस्पॉन्ड टू अ फूड क्यू इन अ हेल्दी वे फॉर इंस्टेंस इंस्टेड ऑफ हैविंग पॉपकॉर्न एट द मूवीज यू कुड गो फॉर अ चिकन और अ वेज सैंडविच 
but not burgers, croissants, submarines or any of the cheesy stuff. Soon you'll start connecting watching a movie with uh, a chicken or a veg sandwich or sometimes nothing at all. I guess eating something healthy at home before you leave could also help. Yeah, absolutely. But you know, most of the food cues are at places where we spend a lot of time, like at home or at work. Uh, let's do an exercise. Let's identify food cues which are the most problematic. Who wants to go first? Oh, Mrs. Parikh. Okay, close your eyes and imagine you're in your house. Um, I'm in the kitchen. And when I make food, there are some packets in the shelf in the kitchen. And when I make food, I feel very hungry. Sometimes one food, sometimes another food. I eat it. Okay, so what is your food cue? Uh, my food cue is snacks. Correct. Now, what are the changes that you can make to avoid this food cue or build a healthy habit? I think I should teach my husband how to cook. And I should rely on him. 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 I should rely on well, you can start by not buying these namkeens altogether or just keep them out of your sight, like in a drawer and not on the shelf. If you have a habit to snack, you can also keep healthy options. Like a whole fruit or some nuts, uh, some fresh cut salad, murmura, chivra. And if you feel like drinking something, then have chaat or buttermilk. This is a great idea. So who wants to go next? Raghu? Yeah, sure. Okay, so close your eyes. Now tell us which room are you in and what are you doing? I'm in my living room. I'm sitting on the sofa and watching television. And I'm eating chips from a packet. Okay, so that's your cue, the TV. Oh. Now that's a common one. To break the connection between watching TV and eating is to make a rule for yourself. Never to eat while watching TV. How you can do that is by keeping an exercise bike or an exercise mat in your TV room. Or you could keep a pack of sugarless gum around you and allow yourself to only have the gum while watching TV. That's easy enough. Uh, I can move the exercise cycle into my room today itself. That's very good. Okay, who wants to be the last volunteer? Me, please. Okay, Tanya, close your eyes. Now imagine you're in your house. Now which room are you in and what are you doing? My favourite. The dining room. We all sit here and eat together. Yehi din ka ek baari hum ikatthe baiht kar gappe maarte hai. Aur jab ta hum gappe maarte rehte hai, mein khana ghaati rehti hai. Okay, so your cue is the dinner table. So tell me, what can you do to make yourself eat less on the table? Can I just serve myself once? Mein apne aap ko baut baari serve karti hai. Do baari dal dal li, do teen baari sabzi dal li, aur thoda sa chicken dal liya, aur then rice. And so if I serve myself everything just once? Perfect. You could also start with a smaller plate and take bowls for dal or curry or even curd. Or you can serve yourself smaller portions also. But serve yourself only twice. Keep the carbs on the lower side. But the most important thing is to remove your plate from the dinner table as soon as you're done eating. Because if you keep on sitting on the table, the tendency to eat keeps on lingering. Right? <laughs> so we've talked about food cues at home, but most of us spend a lot of time at work also. So let's take a break and after that we'll talk about cues at work. Before we move on to the next session, let's go over cues that influence our behavior. What cues us to eat? Hunger, of course, but so can our thoughts and feelings. Being lonely, bored or even happy can make us pick up an unhealthy snack. The sight or smell of food is another powerful food cue. What other people say and do also influences us. We might eat chips at a party simply because a friend offers them. Certain activities like watching TV can also make us think about food. So how do we change these habits? Try to stay away from the food cue. Or keep it out of sight. Keep healthy snacks within easy reach. Or build a new healthier habit. Instead of opening a bag of chips, chew sugar-free gum while watching TV. Also, limit your eating to one place. This will help you distinguish between hunger and other cues to eat. When you eat, limit other activities. The rule is simple. No TV, 
ड्राइविंग और टॉकिंग ऑन द फोन वाइल यू ईट आइए रघु साहब